the perfection of holiness. Death either is or isn't. This death, this deadness, this being dead, it's either on or it's off. We are the opposite of death. Yeah. Now. Whenever we are, death ain't. I didn't know. Hey, your wife's on fire. Under what circumstances does it occur to you to burn yourself to death? Like a Buddhist monk. Immolate yourself. There's an idea. She was crazy. Was she crazy? Oh, you'd think so. Do you think so? You don't have to be crazy to want to kill yourself. You people. What is the matter with you people? Every time I turn my back, you go to killing yourselves. Don't turn your back on a poet. An artist. Or a whore. That's me. You can turn your back on a thief, or a minx, or a politician. An administrator. And they'll just fuck you. But your friends will die. They'll kill themselves. Doused herself with lighter fluid in a coke-filled rage. I'm looking forward to having a companion to not celebrate Christmas with. It's okay if God is just a name for everything we don't know. It may be okay, but it sure is stupid. Why don't you fuck me harder, huh? What? Why don't you? See? I got you there. <laughs> not really. Well, go double or nothing. What you thinking about? I don't know. Tell me. What? Why won't you tell me? Tell you what? Tell me what you're thinking about. I'm reading a book. I can see that. So? What you thinking about? The book. Tell me. What? I'm thinking about LBJ. Who? And Nixon. Why don't you ever talk to me anymore? What do you mean? We don't talk anymore. Sure we do. Well, let's talk then. <sighs> what do you want to talk about? What do you want to talk about? I want to talk about LBJ and Nixon. Well, I want to talk about us. And all the years that lie behind me squandered in trivialities. Not to speak of fornications. That's usually best. What is? Not to speak of it. It's one of those more fun to do than to talk about. I'd like to make an announcement. Well, this better be good. <clears throat> oh, I don't have one. I just... Like to. Right. So what do you do? I'm a philosopher. You give me that shit. I'm a poet sometimes. For a living. Critic. Where? Historian. Of what? Social economist. What? And world-class athlete. You live in a dream. So why'd I dream you? I thought we'd go out for a nice night at the theater, and now there's all this drama. I carry this composition book to support the notion that I am with the press. Well, you never know. Is that right? You never know. I think sometimes you know, you know? You're always saying you know, you know? So you must know, you know? I guess. So then what happens? You forget? Looking for Jesus in the Waffle House across 441 from the Bambi Motel on Christmas Eve. No, we're not. Too bad. You just missed him. He was here? Jesus, you said. Yeah. Nazarene, the Galilean. That's the guy. Well, here's Santa, kicking back with an ice cold Coca-Cola. Oh, and look here. If this isn't a gaily decorated Christmas tree. Appears to be growing out of Santa's boot. We presume this is Santa's boot on this dismembered foot. About goddamn time they played some Christmas music. It's fucking Christmas Eve. You want me to stick my finger up your butt? Not right now, thank you. Just say when. Welcome to the lodge. Any route will take you in. All you do is locate the pain. It doesn't even have to be pain. Any feeling. But pain works best. Cyanide. In a little bottle. 0.7 grams. Marked. Labeled. Keep it. We gotta streak these people's faces with tears. Let me tell you something. Muhammad didn't die for your sins. No. 
Jesus did. Who asked him to? I didn't ask him to. He didn't have to die for my sins. I'll do that. What are they going to do? Kill me? Probably. It's either that. Or an accident. Act of God. Which is what we call anything we can't explain. 